I joined AmeriCorps recently and I wanted to make a blog while I was doing it. A lot of, I feel like a lot of people don't know about AmeriCorps or compare it to be exactly like Peace Corps, which is kind of true, except what a lot of people don't know is that for Peace Corps you have to have gone through college and have to have a bachelor's degree. I joined a, I joined the NCCC program in AmeriCorps, which is which is the National Civilian Community Corps. It's for 18 to 24 year olds. It's a full-time residential team-based program. There are five regional campuses around the nation. Um, Baltimore, Maryland, Vicksburg, Mississippi, right? Yeah. Vinton, Iowa, Denver, Colorado, and Sacramento, California. I'm doing the one in Vinton, Iowa. It's one that I got um, stationed at. Each campus focuses on the states within the region. So in my region, I have North Dakota, South Dakota, Nebraska and Iowa, Minnesota, Wisconsin, Illinois, uh, Indiana, Michigan, and Ohio. I haven't started packing yet, I just have everything laid out on my floor, um, which is kind of a good idea because right now it looks like I have a lot of stuff and I don't think I'll be able to fit it in my bag, so I might have to cut down if you were wondering. This is how much stuff I have right now, which is a lot. I don't know if you can see that picture that I'm going to put up there in editing. <laughs> so I feel like it's a lot because we get one giant duffel bag to put all of our stuff in that we're going to need over the 10 months. And a small backpack. Because you, um, I feel like hmm, you need to bring things like a sheet for a bed, for a twin size bed. Uh, towels, shoes, um, sweaters because it might, it might be cold, toiletries, I feel like all that stuff will take up a lot of room which will leave less room for things that I might want to bring. What they, what they say that you should bring is at least three workout outfits because we're gonna do um, daily PT as far as I know. Be some night clothes. I got um, a pair of sweats and a, um, a loose shirt that I can wear at night. Um, a sweater if I want to um, have some free time and go outside because it's cold out there. I'm only bringing a few casual clothes because because I don't know how much free time we'll get. I don't know how much we'll be able to go out. Um, they say to um, bring clothes for all seasons because you don't know when you will be able to go back home and change out clothes if you want. Okay, so they give you they give you a lot of things, and I found the list of things that they give you. Um, two pairs of cargo pants, two pairs of cargo shorts, a white polo shirt, three t-shirts, um, a hooded sweatshirt, um, a pair of, pair of black pants, a gray button-up shirt, a gray fleece jacket, uh, one neck warmer, a cold weather cap, one red backpack for traveling, a sleeping bag, a pair of overalls, a rain suit, um, rain boots, um, cold weather boots, reflective belt, adjustable belt, winter coat, a pair of steel-toed steel -toed work boots, and a baseball cap. So you get a lot of things, and I also heard that um, while on um, missions, you get a lot of t-shirts as well. So we'll be getting a lot of clothes while we're there, which means we don't need to bring a lot of clothes, which is nice. They've been sending us pictures of our campus to show us what it's like, and it looks really cool. It's like a dorm. It's like kind of college-y, like, which is really neat. Oh, vacations. Um, I don't know what our exact vacation dates are or when we'll be able to come back. I know one of them might be around 4th of July, but the thing is is that if you're on a strike, which is when you're out doing a project in a different state, um, you're not allowed to go on your vacations, which kind of sucks. I guess I'm making this video kind of for me, because I like to make videos of the trips that I've had. Um, also for my friends and family who want to see what my experience is going to be like and for anybody who has any questions about AmeriCorps and wants to know more about it and 
just gets gets to see what it's like on the inside, which is really neat. So I'll see you next time I vlog. Thank you.